So this is the 15th of January 2023. It's the hike for the Caledonian Hill Walking Club. I'm walking from here, Butterston, to Dunkeld. So I'll try and get as much footage as I can throughout the, the hike. So we're just the way to start heading off from Butterston. So Butterston, it's not that far from Blair Gallery. Um, and it's just a, around about a 12 mile walk from here to Dunkeld, Scottish town of Dunkeld. So, oh, it's uh, a wee bit chilly, it is January after the hills, um, snow on some of the tops of the hills up in the distance there, we're not going that high though, but um, certainly a lot of black ice about, so, so be careful. Looks like there's been a wee bit of logging further up here. I'll show you that. It's like there's some sort of monument or something on the top of that hill there. Well, I'll see if we can zoom in and show you. Certainly the hills nearby are not too bad, but behind these hills further on there was snow on the tops of them. We out in the we out towards the glens I think. Well we're not going that far. Uh, but the, the nearby hills are not too bad for snow. Back on the move again.
I got so many out of it. See the snow and the hills in the distance here. <laughs> I'll video this one. So, what will that be there? Craig about how in the distance there. Yeah. Maybe make it the bass out of it. Part of the Sidlaw Hall range. Oh, is that what this? The Laird's house? Alright. Oh, house. Yeah, yeah she says she's a better. of some sort of This button though. I can get my boots cleaned. <laughs> so that was the river crossing. <laughs> or the river crossing, the yeah. burn crossing more like. I just basically we just leapfrogged across. So, uh, no, 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 I'll just wait on the, the others coming up, crossing. It's a bit of an advantage if you've got longer legs, you get across easier, but uh, don't you brace that. Um, so I was just waiting on them and they were just going to be heading along in the track there towards Dunkeld. <laughs> <laughs> Probably are. This time I'll get a better view of them. So 
or something for lunch. Fuck a nice wee spot, just have a wee coffee and one up. six or seven miles still to go. So that's Loch Ordy, I believe anyway. So I say I think that's Loch Ordy. I'm sure a few years ago we came here with a hike club. Uh, I was here with the club and we were somewhere about there we had lunch um, I remember this building it was a winter anyway, it was one of the winter hikes a couple of years ago or something, a few years ago maybe I'll have to look back on that but I've definitely been here before at the Sloth Hardy This is where That's what I mean. Still wee bits of ice <laughs> so yeah, I'm pretty sure this is where we would have stopped for lunch because it's quite a nice spot actually. So it's like a kind of fishing. It's a private boat. It's not like a boat that you can get in. It's locked up, private. So. So, oh, yeah. so far, so good. Been, the weather's held up quite well. So, I've got a few miles still to go. I'm going to end up at Dunkeld. That's Butterstone to Dunkeld. It's about a 12 mile, 12 mile long total trip. You're only up the back of Dundee. It's a memorial up there. We're gonna we're gonna have a look at the it's a memorial or something. So I'll go and see what what that's about. That's a memorial stone. A big grave, I think, is it? A grave or something? Gravestone, maybe. It's just on there. And those remote places. So good. So it's just really on the side of that. Yeah, it's got the. It's like a. <clears throat> right, let's head up here. So onwards and upwards.
getting there, getting there. So we're on route to Dunkeld. It's about two and a bit miles, three miles maybe. It's about just over two miles on that sign, but we might have to, depending on where the bus is parked, um, I reckon this would be a bit. So well, where it is in Dunkeld, we're going to have to walk there, which might make the make it about three miles still to go. But we'll get there in time. So, we're just about back to civilization. Uh, we're on the outskirts of Dunkeld. Uh, it's the sawmill, or Dunkeld sawmill, just past there. Coming up for the main road now. So, it's pretty much near enough the end of the hike. It's been good, huh? it's been, oh, it's been good. It's been uh, a good hike. Uh, I'll show you the sawmill actually, but well, from what I can see of it from here. The sign says four miles to Butterston. The route that we took was about 12 miles, that's four miles by road. So that's pretty much. It's pretty much just back to the, uh, well, not to the start, but we're through to the end. It's not a circular walk, it's a through walk, so um, it's just a stone throw away from the bus stroke car park. Oh, so, Highland off road quad tracks. I've been on that before actually, I'll show you. Uh, I've done the quad biking before here. Uh, it's great fun. So, it was a few years back now, like, but. Uh, yeah, good, good fun. That's the easy way to get about the house on a quad bike. <laughs> so that's just back to the, uh, well, back. That's just the uh, we're at the, I'll keep saying back, that's just reached the end. We're at the bus car park, bus stop, bus car park, whatever you want to call it. Uh, so we're a bit early, the bus isn't here yet. So we're just going to hang on for a wee while and uh, Probably go for a. I think we're going to go for a drink at the one of the bars here at Dunkel Hotel, perhaps. So that's been a good hike. Yeah, thoroughly enjoyed it. Maybe walk into the centre a wee bit because this is all this area is. Uh, this Dunkel, the main wood runs through it. So I'll maybe just walk up there a wee bit and show you Dunkel. As I say, the bus are waiting on the bus coming. So we're a wee bit early, so. I'll go and zoom in, show you. I'll zoom in to the high street of Dunkirk. We'll be going that way anyway, but I'll show you a wee bit of it from here. So 
So I think they're actually just uh, heading out from the car park. Um, and I'm sure I'm maybe just going right to the to the pub now. <laughs> to the bar. So I'm looking forward to that. The only thing is, though, it's just out of sight. I've got the car waiting on this when I get back, so it'll just be soft drinks for me, and afraid. But um, somewhere warm to sit, somewhere quite nice. So it looks like we're all heading in this direction, so we're just going to wait in the warm, warm bar. Just going to wait here for the bus because it's so hard early. So I'll show you a bit more of Dunkeld because we're kind of heading that way. we do that now for you. Turn this camera on for you. So they say that car park does, uh, does accommodate buses as well as cars. That's the main sort of car park for the small town of Dunkeld. There isn't an awful lot here to be honest, but um, it's not a very big place after all. So, so I've been to Dunkeld many times before, like uh, with the club as well. So, I'll pretty much round the video off now because we're just going to go into one of these hotels or bars or something. Anyway, hope you've enjoyed that. It was about 12 miles we walked from Butterstone to Dunkeld via Loch Um It's been really good. I'm not sure if we're all going in the same one or what, I'm not quite sure. But it looks like there's some in there as well. So uh, the the Royal Dunkeld. I think some of them have gone down that way. There's, there's loads of them, eh? There's some, some have continued on down there, like, eh? Just go there. That'd be... That looks quite nice in there, actually. Doing <laughs> what? Got a fight in there. Alive. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so, it's a bit you've been looking forward to most, eh? Looking <laughs> forward to the bar. Yeah. Right, so, I'll run the video off now. Hope you've enjoyed that. You see what else I've got on my channel. And uh, thanks for watching. Okay, see you later on now. Bye.